Welcome to the Money Literate Academy. If you are visiting this channel for the first time, kindly click the subscribe button to become part of our YouTube family for free. Click the notification bell so that anytime we upload a video, you'll be notified instantly. And click the like button if you are feeling the vibe. So let's see how to set up our Alipay account. So you open the Alipay. So you open the Alipay. This is the interface or this is what you are going to see. So you change the this thing. You change the country code to any country you are. Are you in Ghana? Are you in South Africa? Are you in uh, Cameroon? Are you from Egypt? Wherever you are, you choose the country you are. So I am from Ghana. So you choose Ghana. So here that you are going to click to choose. So after you have finished choosing, you enter your number. So you enter your number. After entering your number, you select next. Yes. So you agree to the terms and conditions. So it's loading. You can translate to English to see what they are saying. So I'm going to translate. So they said use your finger to press the screen for verification. So I'm, I'm verifying. So enter code. They have just sent me a code for me to enter to, to verify. So the code was sent to me. So I'm going to verify. 63330 so here you agree to the terms and conditions so you agree so it's still loading you wait patiently for it to load So here, international version is recommended, a version with a similar design and context selected for you. You can set later. You can also enter international version. So you click on it if you want to enter the international version. So you enter international version. So it's loading so you see down here they said later you can go to your settings to change it to the international version so if you want to do it later just select set later set later if you want to do the international version later is set later so it's still loading I think network so if it is delaying if it is delaying you can set it later when you select later this will be the interface of the Alipay yes this is the interface of the Alipay so we are going to do basic settings so you come and click on select me you see me here you click on it so when you click on it here you can change the nickname you can change the nickname to your name so you change the nickname so it's loading So we are going to set the nickname, set nickname. So you enter the name.
so you save then if you want you can add picture yes you can choose from photos you can add picture if you also do if you also want you can leave it that way so i'm going to add a picture so these are just basic settings you have to do on the alipay so now go back to the home page go back to the home page select on me again when select on me on the right hand corner you see settings yeah so you select on the settings when you select on the settings we have the first one we have account and security so you select on account and security so here we are going to set our login password we are going to set our login password so you select on login password you select on login password so they will send you a digit for you to enter they will send you enter sms verification code we have sent you an sms verification code so you enter the code here you enter the code they will send it to your number so you enter the code so i just entered the code so here i'm going to enter a new password enter new password for this number so this is the password you are going to use to log in so you make sure you don't forget the password so after you have finished entering your password just click on save you click on save so login password was set successfully login password was set successfully so it's loading login we have set our password now we are going to set our payment password again so on the alipay we have two passwords login password and then payment password so the payment password is what you are going to be using for transactions so you click on me you select on the settings again so you select on the settings we have payment settings so payment settings payment settings so please set a six digit payment password to proceed next so set so it's going to be a six digit password make sure you don't forget it yes do not use the same number consecutively or continuous numbers in payment password so i'm going to set my six digit password so they will ask you to enter the password again so i have set my password you select on next So now we have set our username or the nickname. We have set login password. We have also set payment password. Now, so they're asking me to add an email to receive important notifications. So you can add an email so that maybe when you forget your password, you can retrieve it yes so you can add an email if you want so enter a valid email address so 
So you enter your email address. It is not necessary, but if you want, you can do it. It's not necessary, but if you want, you can set it. So email verification. A verification code has been sent to my email. So I'll check it up. So I'm going I just went to my email address and then I'm going to enter the digit they sent to me. So it's verifying. It's verifying. So they are asking me to enter my password. So I just enter my password and they told me email added successfully. You get. Mm -hmm. So in case maybe in future you forget of your email, uh, you forget of your password, you can retrieve it. So I think that is the basic things you need on Alipay. Yes, that is the basic thing you need on Alipay. That is the basic thing you need on Alipay. So thank you so much for watching. So in my next video, I'll be teaching you how to log in into the 1688 app.